awesome day in Southern California. It's mid-December, kind of balmy, and good news, we've had some rain. And I understand more rain's predicted for this weekend. Hallelujah. So today, I'm at the Theodore Payne Foundation, which is a native California plant nursery in the valley, and I'm shopping for some California native plants. Today I'm at the Grow Native Nursery on the grounds of the West LAVA. It's a native California plant nursery that's actually sponsored by the Rancho Santa Ana Botanic Garden in Claremont, California. But because this is on the west side of LA, it's accessible to lots of Angelinos. Today I'm purchasing a couple of plants to replenish my yard. So you can see there's lots of plants to choose from here. They're California natives, which means they're adapted to our semi-arid climate. There's a wide variety of plants today, here today, from grasses to succulents to more lush ferns and things like that. So come by, check it out, and hopefully you'll find something that's suitable for your yard. The best time to buy and plant native California plants is actually in the fall. Unfortunately, Many of these plants don't look at their best in the fall. Take these plants here, for example. This is called a Matilaha Pompe. In May, in my yard, at the end of each one of these stems is a giant flower that looks like a fried egg with beautiful crepey petals and a red or a yellow-orange center. If you look at it right now, it looks kind of plain. So again, it's hard to know how beautiful some of these plants will look in the spring when you're buying them in the fall. <laughs> 